Hello you guys, it's Maggie. Welcome back to another vlog. I just woke up. I am getting ready for the day. We have a busy day around the apartment. Actually a very exciting day because my room is finally getting painted. It's the last day with the yellow walls and the purple walls in the bathroom. After today, everything will be all white and I'm so excited. If you've been watching my videos for a while, you'll know like how excited I am for this because I like do not like the color of my room right now. Let me see if you guys can see. Yeah, it's like a really ugly yellow, but anyway, it's being painted today and I'm so excited and um, that's what's up. So I have like a few other things I'm going to do to my room like these next few days. So I guess today and tomorrow will be one vlog and it'll be obviously as you guys can tell by the title my bedroom transformation and yeah the apartment is just like coming together so nicely and i am really really happy with it i got new furniture in my last vlog i showed it and i just have more stuff being delivered in the next few weeks and then i am gonna film an apartment tour for you guys once everything is all done because i I'm just like finally putting everything together the way that I want it and I'm renewing my lease if you also didn't see one of my last vlogs and have no idea what's going on I've been living in this apartment for a year and I had the option to renew my lease or find another apartment and I looked around and I just like couldn't find what I wanted and I feel like the only thing that I wasn't obsessed about with this apartment was the color of my walls and just like a few other things that were quick fixes and also i realized like that if i just got rid of some of my old furniture pieces and sold them and bought new ones and just like redid my space it would feel like a whole brand new apartment and that's what i'm doing right now so i'm really really happy and excited so make sure you're subscribed so you don't miss out on any more apartment vlogs and also follow me on instagram i always have a link down below and on my instagram that's where i put like my real time um updates and stuff so you definitely don't want to miss that so i always have a link down below but anyway i am getting ready to go get coffee as you guys can probably tell i'm like i feel like first thing in the morning until I have coffee, I'm just like so tired. And that's me right now. I also went to bed kind of late and I got up early because the painter's here and um, he's finishing up the bathroom in the hallway. But Emma's room is all done and it looks so good. It's all white. So I'm gonna do some skincare and wash my face so I can go get coffee run errands and do everything that I need to do. Also, Milo and I are gonna go on a little walk too. The weather's like so weird today in Boston. It's like cold and very, very windy, but it's like almost May. <laughs> so I'm like, what do I even wear in this type of weather? And I also need to do laundry. You guys can't even see, but my pamper is like overflowing with stuff. I need to do laundry and I'm really sad because I wanted to wear my new sweat set from Mad Happy and I can't because it's not clean. I'm gonna cleanse my skin using, what's the date today? By the time you guys see this video, I'm pretty sure you will know about this from my Instagram. But if you don't, one of my favorite brands, Mask Skincare. I love their CBD lip balm, like that really big one that I always use, and their Spotless Serum, which is right here, my favorite of all time. And then they also have sheet masks. They have under eye masks. They just have so many amazing products, and I've been using them for a really long time. And I'm so excited because they came out with a face wash. It's clean, it's non-toxic, and there's only like eight or nine ingredients in it and i've been using it for about two weeks now my skin just feels so clean like i'm gonna show you guys the way that it makes my skin feel is insane it looks like honey it smells so good i like to do it like I, everyone's different but i like to take it 
and put it on my face when my face isn't wet yet because there are a bunch of really nice oils in it which i feel like just melt away like all of your makeup and anything else also i don't know if i mentioned but i am the face of their new cleanser and i'm very excited about it because like i said this has been a brand that i have been using for a really long time i've met their team like they're just so amazing and just really really great people and although i do love their products their team is just amazing and i love like working with people that are like them they're just so nice they're just a really great team to work with sorry milo's in here and he wants to get out with your hair scratching um but anyway that's that i'm gonna have more info on it coming soon but i just want to give you guys a little sneak peek um but i'm gonna rinse this off is sponsoring today's video and they are having their 20% off site-wide birthday sale and that applies to Brooklyn and products they have amazing products I use their towels I'll show you guys these are my favorite towels they're huge like I don't even know if you guys can see like I can't even hold it up they're so big but like when I wrap it around my body it's legit down to my ankles they're so good and they're such good quality they're so thick and um, Oh, they're just like the best. They're so soft. They're so thick. It feels like I'm at a hotel when I use them. And that's like what I was going for. And I also use their bed sheets. I have the Lux Satin Collection or Sateen. And then I also have the linen. And I got new bedding, which I'm going to be putting on at my bed once my room is painted. So you guys will see that later in the video. And I just wanted to mention that they're having their sale because they don't have sales very often. And it's just a great time to stock up on very quality bedding or towels whatever you're looking for um whether it's for you or a gift for somebody else like i'm obsessed with bedding i used to ask for, for christmas every year for my mom so you definitely don't want to miss out i will leave a link down below in the description and then your discount will be applied at checkout when you use my link so everything will be down there for you guys and thank you brooklyn for sponsoring today's video i just got my coffee i'm so excited medium cold brew one cream salted caramel cold foam from dunkin donuts It's so good, you guys. You need to get it. You need to get this. Tag me and let me know what you think. Hi, guys. I'm home. Mac and I got lunch. And we went to the North End and got sandwiches, but ah, I can't even believe it. I'm standing in my bedroom right now, which has been painted, only one coat, and it just like looks so much better. It looks so bright, and I'm obsessed with it. So I'm going to show you guys a little sneak peek, and it'll fully be finished tomorrow, so... This is what it's looking like so far. Everything's all covered and basically like moved out of the room. But it's white and I love it. And it's going to look so good once it's done and the furniture's all set up again and I can put the curtains back up. And I am just so obsessed. I know that it's going to look so good once it's all finished. And it's going to be so nice to like film content in here and just like do stuff that i used to do at my old apartment in my room like more outfit of the day pictures in the mirror i'm gonna have like a nice area to do that for you guys and also i want to start filming more on tiktok and just getting more like content out like fashion content rather than like vlogs and stuff um but yeah that's that i have a hair appointment in a little bit i'm going to see jonna just for a trim i honestly like love the length of my hair right now but i just want the pieces like around my face to be shorter and have like more layers because it's been honestly like a couple of months since I got my hair cut I haven't gotten cut since February 
and it's now end of April so it's been a little bit I'm gonna go get a little trim and do that and then probably go to the grocery store pick up some stuff to get for dinner tonight but I just wanted to give you guys a little update of my room because I love it so so much I'm so happy with the way that it looks so far and the bathroom is also getting done tomorrow so the purple walls will be gone and I'm just so freaking excited you guys have no idea this feels like a brand new apartment to me like it's the weirdest thing ever but even the living room just feels so different also the bar stools are coming in the morning you guys will see those but this is again what it looks like I showed it in my vlog yesterday all the furniture from the living room got delivered but if you haven't seen it the vlog this is what it looks like rug coffee tables new and then I have this console table right here which I just got also don't mind everything from my room is literally in this area because obviously it's being painted but that is that right Milo you're so excited for the new apartment also Milo's just not been feeling good I don't know why but he hasn't been feeling good yesterday and today which is so unlike him because like he never gets sick and uh, he just hasn't been feeling good so yeah i just got out of the hair salon guys my hair is like staticky and i don't know why jonna said it because it was like dry in there today but this is what my hair looks like you probably can't tell really because of my jacket because it's black and my hair is so dark but it looks so good when I go to the hair salon, I always just like get a trim and so she will wash and dr she'll wash my hair, trim the bottom. I wouldn't say like the bottom, I don't know exactly what she does, but she trims my hair and then she blows it dry and then she puts the layers in. And I just get layers and I ask her to do the pieces like around my face shorter because I like to put it up and then have these pieces come out. And these pieces have just been like so long for a while so it looks really good but it's like sticking to my face um but i really like the way that it came out i go to jonna rago she's on newberry street she's the best ever and honestly like if you're in boston just go to her and i feel like if i just am like what should i do she like knows exactly what looks good and she will never like do anything to like sabotage you like she is so good at what she does and I feel like I've every single time I've seen somebody come out after seeing her I'm like your hair looks so good and they're always like I went to Jonna and I'm like exactly why your hair looks so good so yeah looks amazing I love her she's the one who does Emma's blonde and she's the best so yeah obsessed I just got back from Whole Foods I'm gonna make a homemade tomato soup tonight and do grilled cheese so I bought a loaf of sourdough and I want to cut it like thick that's why I didn't buy the one that was already pre-cut so I got this I'm really excited to make this I made it last fall and it was so good I'll share with you guys obviously like how I make it as we go and I got a water I think like there's something so satisfying just like drinking out of a water that you get from the store and I love this brand, Mountain Valley, if you guys are watching this. I love your water. It's my favorite. And I got two pints of tomatoes. So I got this mini pint. And then I also got these local tomatoes from the vine. I got two of those as well. I'm going to do a mix between like little tomatoes and big tomatoes. And then I got some of this Tulsi ashwagandha tea by Organic India. Got these for Milo little bones and then I also got some shallots for the soup basil some of this organic valley raw cheddar cheese for the sandwiches and then I got some garlic cloves some fruit for the morning and also this lemonade because it looked really good
This was so easy to prep. It literally took me like five seconds. I washed all the tomatoes, threw them in, and did three shallots because they were a little bit small. And then underneath, there is a full head or like clove of garlic. And I just cut it in half and then put it face down and then did basil, olive oil, salt and pepper. And I put it into my La Crusette pan. And I'm gonna put this in the oven for I think like 30 to 40 minutes on 480. Honestly, if there's one purchase that's like the best purchase of my life that I get so much use out of, it is this pan right here. Like you can cook literally anything in it. You can do soups, you can do chicken, pastas. Like I legit use it for everything. And I made a really good like shredded chicken and I made burrito bowls the other night. It was amazing. It's the best purchase I've ever made, so highly recommend. I'm just gonna throw the lid on and then stick this right in the oven. soup is done it's so good as you guys saw I just put everything once it was all roasted into my Vitamix and then just added it back to the pot and then put it on a low simmer and just let it heat up while I cooked the grilled cheeses over here which looks so good oh my god those look so good it's the next day and I've been just really trying to clean the apartment all day and get it ready for the bedroom to be done and just like i have a ton of boxes from shipments that have come in the mail that i had to break down earlier today and like get rid of all that i'm still waiting for the bar stools to come they're supposed to come today so we're waiting on those i'm pretty sure if they don't come today they will probably come tomorrow so you guys will be able to see the bar stools in the next vlog and i finally cleaned up the kitchen area a little bit the painter will be done tomorrow which I'm very excited about but I'm gonna show you guys a little bedroom update I have my new sheets which I wanted to show you guys in this vlog but like I said my room won't be done till tomorrow because he needed to do an extra coat of paint to cover up the ugly yellow walls <laughs> but these are the sheets that I got from Brooklinen this is the linen collection we have a linen duvet and then these right here are pink linen sheets they're like a really beautiful baby pink let me see if i can open this up and show you guys oh they're so cute they're gonna be perfect for spring and summer they're just like so cozy i love linen for this time of year just because it's like so lightweight and it just like feels so good on your skin i'm really excited to put these on my bed once my room is all done and this is what the room looks like it's almost done <laughs> i'm so excited i'll show you guys a little 360 but it just makes the room look so much bigger and I really love it. And I feel like it really just like brightens up the space. I can't wait to like put the bed back, put the tables in and get everything all set up like it was. But I'm really excited. I'll do a full bedroom reveal in one of my next vlogs. And the bathroom's almost done. He only has one more coat left to do in the bathroom. But it's just so nice having white walls and not having it be purple and yellow anymore. I feel like it's really going to just like shift my whole mood and like vibe even being in this apartment. And I'm very, very excited. So stay tuned for the complete new bedroom and bathroom tour which will probably be in my next vlog because i'm gonna end off this vlog here get it edited i'm gonna start a new vlog and show you guys like the finished bedroom bathroom like once everything is done 
and I can't wait. So make sure you're subscribed so you don't miss out on any of the, I wouldn't say like apartment renovations because I feel like only, like we're not doing any, like tearing anything down, but a lot is changing. So subscribe so you don't miss out on any of that. I'm very excited. I really wanna have everything done and have an apartment tour up for you guys within maybe like the next month or two. So yeah, I love you so much. Thank you for watching. And I hope that you guys enjoyed this vlog and I will see you in my next video. Bye.